Hey guys, uh, so it's been a little bit, maybe, I don't know when I post this. Anyways, uh, some of you had asked me about food in Japan, uh, whether I had any likes or dislikes or surprises. Um, as you may recall from maybe a previous video, I talked about how um, I came to decide on Japan. Um, and you'll notice that I did a lot of research throughout my life, maybe not a lot. Anyways, bit by bit, I've learned a lot um, of cultural things, and one of them, of course, is food. Um, so when I came to Japan, I wasn't really surprised by anything. Um, I knew coming in that sushi was kind of a thing, but it wasn't as big as I thought it would be. I guess that's the big surprise, uh, sashimi and stuff. Um, seafood is obviously a main thing. This place is an island, a pretty big island, but an island nonetheless. Um, I come from Massachusetts, um, where seafood is readily available, um, so we do have some Japanese restaurants or Japanese style restaurants, so I kind of came in here with a, a little bit of practice too. Um, I knew how to use chopsticks, no problem. Um, so yeah, it's not a big deal, um, for me at least. Um, my favorite foods, well here are emo fry, which is like, uh, part of my city's area, um, food, and maybe it's not wholly Japanese, but I do love Japanese curry, uh, it's sweet, I also like the Indian curry that's served there, ugh, so good, um, I've become a very big curry addict while in Japan, it's kind of crazy for me, um, what else is there for food, um, one of my areas specialty foods, we'll call it. Um, it's called shimotsukare, and I will say it's among one of the few foods I cannot and will not eat while here in Japan. Um, my dictionary defines it as leftovers boiled with a salmon head. Um, you'll find various descriptions of what it is, and it's just, it's really gross. Maybe that's just me. Uh, very few people actually like it. I don't know. I don't know why they still serve it. I guess it's just because it's the thing to do. It's tochigi. Um, but I guess you know. And the try it. Just try it. Um, I do like natto. I like umeboshi, which is like a soured plum. Um, I like a lot of things that my coworkers are always surprised that I like. Um, I don't like octopus and I don't really like squid. Um, the flavors are fine. Well, mm, they're so so. But um, it's actually the texture. They have like a strange, like, chewy texture to them. Um, I just I just can't get over that. Uh, I have tried on several occasions. It's just it's difficult. I can't do it. Um, so I actually, for you guys, took pictures of. Uh, school lunches, which are called kyushaku, um, for one week. Uh, my kids had a blast with that. I'd come with my little iPod. Um, I'd come with this. It's an iPod Touch. It's about two years old. Uh, clearly, I use it often. Uh, Disney, everything. And, um, yeah, so <laughs> I took pictures of it. The kids asked me why. I had to explain to them that it's an interesting thing. School lunch is very different around the world than it is um, in Japan. The kids thought that was pretty fascinating uh, in itself. So uh, it, it's a learning experience maybe for you guys, but it was also for my students, so thank you. Um, so I hope you will enjoy, and we'll see you later.